How's it going today, tubes? So today I had to run down to um, the city where uh, I remember way a while back there where I got that new cable modem thingy. And we ran down, we grabbed that, and we come back, and blah, blah, blah. And anyways, um, I've been having trouble with that friggin' thing. It's the SMC one. It's got the Rogers thingy stamped onto it. And uh, what it was doing was uh, you'd be okay doing your internet-y stuff or playing games for about 20 minutes or so, and then all of a sudden just, whoosh, just chops you off. So, yeah, you lose all your connection. Everything was screwed, you know? And uh, sometimes if you went out, you'd come back, and it was it would be okay for another, you know, half an hour or something. And uh, sometimes it wouldn't reconnect at all. You'd have to, like, power cycle the friggin' thing, like, pull the plug out of the back, let it sit for, like, 15 seconds, and then plug it back in, let it do its frickin' thingies again. I'm trying to get this light off my head. It, uh, uh, do its thingies, and then you'd be all right again for, like, another 20 minutes, and all of a sudden, boom, chops you again. It was starting to really tick me off, you know. I'm like, I just paid $200 for this freaking cable modem -y thing, and it's freaking garbage. So, talking to Vlogging Life and stuff, and he says, oh yeah, those SMCs are freaking junk, man. I'm like, yeah, I think I might take her back, so. So, yeah, I went touring down to the city there today anyways, and uh, jumped into the Rogers store there where we got her, and I said to him, dude, this thing's a piece of freaking, freaking junk, eh? He's like, oh, why, what's wrong? I'm like... Well, like was what I explained to you, it's freaking chops you off like every 20 minutes. Oh, okay. I'm like, he's like, I could, I could replace that for you. I'm like, well, yeah, but I don't want the same freaking piece of junk like that you gave me here. Well, okay. I was like, I want one of your freaking Cisco ones. Apparently, uh, Vlog of Life says they're, uh, they're their cat's meow there, so. Uh, so, yeah, so, buddy's like, whoa, okay. Not too brilliant, this guy, apparently. But, yeah, anyways, he looked her up and scanned her, and if I had her back within 15 days, I would have got my 200 bucks back, so it's like, great, it's been over that, it's been months and a bit now, I guess. So, I was kind of screwed there, you know, no money back, but uh, he's like, well, we'll just exchange it for this one, and this is the one you bought. I'm like, okay, so I don't get my money back, but I get this one that's better for nothing basically you know like I've paid for the other one so I've now paid for this one I just exchanged it right he's like yeah yeah I'm like why not frick wouldn't you just have done that to begin with and not give me this crappy one you know I said to them I don't want to be renting this freaking thing I want to buy one. Oh, well this is the one the SMC is the only one that we have that you can buy so I'm like okay She's like, oh yeah, this was before. She's like, oh yeah, the Cisco ones, they're the only ones that we have for renting. I'm like, well, whatever. I was getting frustrated, so I just left the store paying 200 bucks for that one, and away we went, right? Figured I was all good, but apparently not. So, anyways, we got the Cisco one home here, and uh, we're just going to unbox her here, and uh, I guess hook her up and try her. But uh, before we do that, i got to stuff some of this crap into my gut. You know, and... Uh, where the heck did it go? Oh, it's behind there. Pop. But uh, let's just do the unboxing first here and uh, we'll see how it's looking. Okay, so this one better be not junk because I don't think they have anything else to exchange again with. So, freaking Cisco. Cisco, there's your uh, getting started thing. And there's the Dewey. It's a bit smaller than that other one, that's for sure. It comes with a router in it too, so that's pretty good, I guess. But uh, what do we got under here now, tubes? Well, just the power cords, and I guess we'll need all that crap. Probably don't need that. Don't think it's long enough to hit my computer anyway, so six feet. And a dongly key. Huh. Well, that must be uh, instead of a CD. Oh, yeah. So I'll start that, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, okay. But uh, let's go hook her up. I'm going to stuff this crap down my uh, freaking gut first. And, uh, and uh, yeah, we'll go uh, hook her up and fire it up. Uh, hopefully we get uh, hooked back on. Okay, so I just can't wait. i got to plug her in. So, where the do we go there? Oh, look at them lights, eh? Buddy says this should freaking work. Freaking better work, bud. Look at all the lights! 
Now what, um, what does it say in here? Online, Ethernet. Oh, just went out. That's, oh, back on. One online link. Link, link. I guess that's, oh, it's off again. Well, we'll let her, uh, what's flashing there now? Apologize. DS is flashing. Don't know if that's a good thing or not, but. Anyways, my uh, computer's in in uh, Ethernet 1 here, and uh, the other one outside is 2 on the table out here, but it's not on right now, so. But uh, let's re chooch this. Let's grab one of these oh. uh, friggin' steamers oh. from Cleveland, but uh, here we go. Alright, the uh, heck let's are we watching? Have at her and get her asses in the work. Who the yeah. heck's this guy? Oh, she's all. Oh, oh, oh! We're going high speed with vlogging life. Friggin' right! Anyways, buddy, I gotta chop you off for a sec. Apologize. And uh, hopefully this thing has no internet access. Great. She might take a minute. I don't know, maybe I gotta reboot the thing, but it looks like we got all our chooch and lights on here now. Power DS US online. And I'm flashy flashy. Uh, so yeah, I guess that's somewhat good. And uh, we still got no access here, so let's do a, a troubleshooting problems. Move my disgusting cups out of the way for you. So that oh, it's on now. I think. Freak sakes! To say here. Well, the little thingy's plugged, so let's open up the, uh, uh, for freak's sake, um, open up my video page here, and she's good. Oh, freak, yeah. But let's do, hang on, tubes, I'm going to bring up this web page and we're going to test this thing here. So we're going to do this internet speed test again, uh, speed test on that, I think that's it there. And we'll wait till this fires up. We want to select, where is it now? It's on, oh, fell on, let's go. Come on, really? Toronto, maybe. Toronto. Okay, so, oh, 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 oh. It's not as fast as it should. Oh, there we go. Got a bit more throttle out of her. And upload should be, should be two. Better Friggin' me too, that's what I'm friggin' paying friggin' for. Oh yeah, we're pretty close to two there. Oh yeah, we got two. So that's good, that seems to be working. It's supposed to be 50, 50, uh, uh, 50 down and two up, so we're good. So that sort of seems good. Should probably be a little better, better hopefully. Um, but I got one other story right now. And I want to tell you that I think is one of the most amazing things and weirdest things that has ever happened to Bill's D-Max, me. Okay, I'm going to try to give you as many, many details as I can for this story, so it might take a few minutes. But uh, remember a few videos back there where I was doing the backhoe on at Randy's house? Um, I think there was two or three videos we did on that. And, uh, anyways, nothing to do with the back one part, but Randy, um, he's the funeral director in town here, a good buddy of mine. Uh, he knew I was going down to the Rogers place this morning here, so he said to me, Hey, hey, while you're going down there, would you mind going over to Princess Auto for me? And, uh, grabbing me, uh, frickin', uh, roll of that monster speaker wire. I'm like, sure, why not? I love frickin' ride to Princess Auto. One of my favorite places ever, eh? So, off we went to Princess Auto after the Rogers. And, uh, freaking got down there and, uh, I had a sheet of paper he printed out for me so I knew exactly what I was getting and stuff. And, uh, so I get in there and, uh, grab a roll of wire and, uh, you know, 
walking around shooting uh, whatever you're shooting down there and uh, this uh, very pretty blonde uh, lady walks up to me and uh, she says uh, this might seem a little strange I'm like okay my name's Kristen and I sent you the fifty dollar gift card from the Princess Auto uh, head office in uh, uh, West there I'm like what I kind of freaked I'm like what right in the middle of the store eh? And uh, she's like, yeah, my name, I'm from the blah, blah, store, and I, I was the one that sent you the, the, the gift card. I'm like, really? She's like, yeah, I saw you walk in, and I thought I better, I better come over and say hi to you and stuff, and thank you and stuff. I'm like, I'm like, what the frick are you doing here, you know? Like, that's like, well, Manitoba or something, I think it is, the head office. I'll have to check the sheet after it there. I can't really remember, but she was apparently in doing, uh, uh, what do you call it, about the around the stores and stuff and you know like I guess inspecting them and stuff and uh, basically touring around the stores around this area so I'm like what are the freaking chances of that of me walking into the Princess Auto at blah 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 9 30 10 o'clock in the morning and she's there the exact same time and spies me across the freaking store and says I know that guy I gotta go say hi to him so I'm like holy frig like <laughs> I mean think about it think about it tubes the chances of that the chances of that is like slim to freaking never ever ever happening, you know, like one in a bazillion bazillion kind of thing. So I was like pretty freaking pumped, eh? I'm like, holy cow. So yeah. But uh, I talked to her for a few minutes. She looked like she was in a bit of a hurry. She had to go to some of the other stores around, I guess. So um, yeah, but she says, oh yeah, we flew in last night and you know, blah, blah, blah. We're doing a tour today over all the stores around here. So I'm like, holy small friggin' world, eh? But, uh, anyways, I just thought that was really, really cool. Really friggin' cool to actually meet up with this lady that sent me the gift card, so. But, uh, I don't know, I was kind of, kind of, sort of, like, deer in the freaking headlights, kind of stunned, you know. I probably didn't say too much to her, I don't even really remember, you know, but, but, uh, yeah, but, uh, <laughs> I don't know, it was just, it was just one of those weird things. But anyway, she's still going, so, uh. Seems to be pretty good. Uh, we'll have to get online and playing some games and stuff, and uh, and uh, uploading the videos and stuff will make her make her make her work pretty hard. So, yeah. But um, there's my other router which I don't really need now because this has got thingy in the back of it, right? But uh, yeah. Anyways, uh, whenever I fire in that line to run down to the garage, I'm thinking of running it. Oh look, Princess Auto. Friggin' right. There's one for you there, two tubes. Look at that one. Eh? What would you rather be? Ooh, I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, the line. There's the... Uh, oh, just above the bucket there. I don't know if you can really see it, but... Uh, I've got like a drain tappy there, so for draining the outside tap in the wintertime, right? But probably... Probably gonna drill right through that freaking sign there <laughs> with the new uh, Ethernet line that's gonna go down to the garage eventually, and then... Uh, We'll just run it on the wall and then plug her in. So I'm thinking only maybe. Well, actually, no. It might be lower than that. It might be down more about this Canadian tire. Sorry, apologize for that. Because the the tap is outside and it's above ground, and the ground probably starts about the Princess Auto, and then you know when it, oh, it might even be below the Canadian tire. I don't know. I don't know yet. So, but it'd be around there somewhere, somewhere tubes. But uh, I want to go about a foot under the ground with it. So it'd be. Uh, you know, not super, super deep, but not uh, going to be, you know, hitting her with your shovel if you're digging in the flower gardens or something. So, friggin' right. But uh, I feel like feeling sick all afternoon, so we're going to drive this uh, freaking horrible refried, deep fried, refried crap into my gut. There's nothing like a bit of McDonald's to make a person regular. Well, tubes, I don't know. This thing's got the built in Wi Fi on it, too, and uh, I can't freaking get it to work. The uh, frickin' setup thingy here, the uh, this dongly key thingy, whatever it is you call them, you put in there and it does its setup thing and it sits there looking for your network and setting it up and then it says, it cannot find bowl on network. It's like, what? Well, really? It's six feet away from you. <laughs> I couldn't find it. Why can't you? So I guess I'm going to end up having to break open this one for up here anyway, so I guess we'll do a little unboxing video on this guy too, for freak's sakes, eh? Well, find the uh, best spot for doing a 
bunch of dice here, and we'll peel this open. I don't know why I couldn't get that other router to work. Like for the for the Wi-Fi, the regular wired stuff works, but the Wi-Fi, I don't know. I couldn't get it to work. So there's our uh, this freaking camera position for you. There she be. So just the pluggy dewy and uh, oh. Vlogging life says to me this thing looks like a George Foreman grill. I guess it sort of does, doesn't it? <laughs> That'll make him giggle when he watches this. Yeah, buddy, Foreman rules. So, and then there's a little setup CD in here, I guess. Uh, yeah, so let's go try this one now. I guess I don't need this. I don't think it'll reach. Oh, yeah, I will need this. Apologize. So we'll get that hooked up too. Well, there isn't too much exciting on that, but we'll uh, leave it like that so I can see the uh, freaking. Uh, oh, I feel horrible, dude. Now, oh, definitely gonna be something coming up my bum later. I'll tell you, that's just nasty. You probably didn't need to know that though. So, anyways, that's on. Now I'm gonna just see if I can even. Uh, Vlogging oh, life. Friggin' right. Uh, oh, Cisco. She found her. She connect to her though. Probably gotta go in and do some setting up or something. Taking his time, isn't it? Come on, really? Frig sakes. What the heck? Hmm. I don't know, Tubes. Well, I'm going to follow everything that they freaking tell you here, and if this isn't successful, I don't know what the frig is going on. I have read everything, blah, blah, blah. I didn't really, but, you know, I love checking and clicking those things. So, connect the end of the power cable to the router, and the other end of the light, I did that. The router power is pitched, turn it on. Well, it just came on. Connect to one end to the uh, we'll cable to the yellow internet port on the back of your router. Connect the other end of the cable to your modem. Did that. If you're replacing an existing router, disconnect the cable from the modem. Say next. Looking for networks. Connecting to the network. See, this is what it was doing before with the uh, that uh, built-in one to the modem, and then it just comes back. Could not find your network. So like, what? What the frig? So I have done exactly everything that they tell you to do. And if this doesn't work, I don't know what the frig's going on. Anyways, I'll let this uh, hammer through a minute here, and uh, so it's going to take several minutes, and uh, then we'll come back to it. There we friggin' go, tubes. I don't know what the frig is going on here. It says, we could not find your router. Router name, password, I don't know all that crap. This is the exact same freaking screen that it gave me before. So, that's going to drive me nuts. I don't know, Tubes, what's going on here. I've got technically three Wi-Fi modems. Um, I've got the one I got today. It's got a Wi-Fi in it. And I've cracked open that uh, the other Wi-Fi modem. Same thing. And I've even... Uh, tried my other uh, Linksys older one right there even tried it and same thing so I don't know what the freak is going on here but maybe you would know better than, than, than what I'm doing here but uh, three for three and three strikeouts I don't I don't get it so but anyways we'll have to figure it out or call the the tech guys or get vlogging life down maybe maybe he'd have a better idea what the frig's going on here because this is really starting to tick me off one of them's got to do something you know but I can see all the networks I can see the modems the routers and stuff but I can't connect to it so I don't know but anyways uh, we'll, uh, we'll maybe go rip a kinder egg open right now and give you a little bit more of a sort of an interesting something to the video so anyways let's uh, go friggin do that I guess 
Well, tubes, and then there was three. I bet we use this guy that's all by himself on the end here. Well then. I don't know what he thinks in there. Well, I guess there's only one way to find out. Cracker open, eh? Cracker open. Well, that sounds pretty solid. Sailboat, car. Ooh, ah, another one of them stupid friggin' whatchamacallem guys. Uh, that holds the stupid little magnifying glassy thing. Come on, buddy, get your head in there for freak's sakes. So we've got a whole whack of these ones now. Let's see what we got friggin' up on the shelf here. I could have swore I had more than three of them. I must have threw some out or something. Getting tired of the same friggin' things all the time, eh? I don't know. But, uh, freak, we got lots of friggin' potato gun ammo coming up. I'll friggin' tell you that one. But anyhow, yeah, if you guys have any info on setting up this friggin' wireless stuff, I don't know why I'm having so much trouble because before it was basically just like a plug and play. You'd find your thing, you'd hook onto her, and bang away you'd go but pfft, something's weird you know three freaking modems I got in there wireless stuff and none of them work I don't get it I don't know what I'm doing wrong like uh, we got brand new computer we got brand new modem and we got another brand new modem and yes it should freaking work I, I don't know why it's not so Anyways, if you guys have any thought on that, uh, freaking send me a message and let me know. So, yeah, anyways, have a good freaking day, Tubes, and uh, we'll freaking talk at you next time. If you would be interested in a shout-out for your YouTube channel, please send a letter with your YouTube username to the following address, and I will slap it on one of my videos. And if you send me a return address, I'll also send you back uh, one of my Bill's TMAX stickers. Have a good day, Tubes.